basically go out and find all the talented people and try and persuade them to come and work for our company over everybody else's. So we're a visual effects company uh, or a post-production house and we work exclusively on feature films. So we've worked on anything from the Harry Potter films through to Inception. Um, we've currently just finished The Dark Knight Rises, which is the new Batman film. And we handle all the computer generated imagery to do with all of those films. So the difference between visual effects and special effects is special effects is when you take something in real life and you actually film it for real and visual effects is anything that you create using a computer. So if you wanted to create a special effect, you might make a model of a building and you might actually blow it up. Um, if you wanted to do that for visual effects, you would create that using computer-generated imagery. You'd start off with a model and then you would have effects artists who would blow that up and add in fire and particles and smoke and things like that. My favorite is probably Inception, um, I think most people in the company would say they've got a bit of a soft spot for that one because that won us our Oscar, um, our first Academy Award, and we worked on all of the CGI to do with that film, so there weren't any other visual effects companies involved, it was just us. I just hope to raise the profile of visual effects, um, let people know that it's actually happening right here in the UK. A lot of the studios are all based out in Los Angeles or Hollywood, and lots of visual effects stuff is happening right here in the UK, so I just want to let people know that and also show them some of the skills that they might need to get a job in visual effects if they're interested in working in that one day. Most of the artists will start off by being a runner um, and they'll sort of work their way up from there. It's a very junior position in most sort of TV and film companies. Uh, me personally, I've kind of worked in entertainment my whole life, so I started off at uh, a theatre production company um, and then I moved on to a publishing house as well, doing magazines and websites and things like that. And then I got my job at Double Negative, so that's kind of how I've ended up here. I would say the best thing they can do, um, depending on whether they're still at school or not, um, maybe sort of think about which subjects they're choosing at A-level, think about going to university if that's um, an option for them. There's some brilliant courses in the UK, um, particularly sort of in Bournemouth, there's a couple in Wales, a couple in Scotland, so there's lots of options for people to go and study visual effects or computer animation um, and then, yeah, create a brilliant, brilliant showreel, don't worry too much about putting music or anything onto your showreel, two to three minutes, your best, best work, and then send it down to us and we'll take a look.